What are we expecting from America, from China, from India, from Japan and all the others? Uh, morning, Anna. I think we expect some kind of coordinated action, as we've been reporting over the last uh, few days. That involves the world's top four oil consumers, importantly, the US, China, uh, Japan and India. And we heard from Indian officials this morning. India it expects to announce a modest uh, stockpile release of 5 million barrels a day uh, at some point today, and that oil will come onto the market in the coming weeks. Now, it's not a huge number. It's uh, less than India consumes in one single day. So I think the action here is largely symbolic. We await the details from Biden later today and then what China and Japan decide to do. Um, but the real question that traders are focusing on now is how does OPEC Plus respond? They meet on next week on December the 2nd. They had been expected to continue with these monthly 400,000 barrel a day hikes. Uh, that's now in the balance. Interesting to see JP Morgan putting out a note, Kalanovich saying that oil is remarkably cheap. That will probably play in uh, to the hands of OPEC Plus as they consider their response. Can they look through this if it is just symbolism? Uh, yes. I mean, the cheap comment is actually very interesting. I mean, it's worth bearing in mind that everyone said uh, they need to do this to get gas prices down, as Joe was talking about how, what a hot political issue that is. But 75 80 dollars is not especially expensive by historical standards sure it's a lot more than last year but the obama administration went years at 100 dollar oil without doing this so i think it just shows how sensitive it is but to your point tom it means that opac can say really is this really a crisis we think the oil market looks in good shape and is recovering nicely